The popular Netflix series 13 Reasons Why has created controversy surrounding the glorification versus the reality of suicide. In the show, the character Hannah Baker created cassette tapes to explain her mindset and her reasons for committing suicide. This concept has sparked debate over whether her tapes intended to show blame or her tapes intended to explain her thoughts. In light of developing controversy, the truth about suicide needs to be heard. So in the spirit of the show, Suicide, welcome to your tape. Every year in the United States, 864,950 people attempt suicide. In the amount of time this video has been playing, one person has attempted suicide. By the time this video will be over, it is likely that a person will have died because of a suicide attempt. Statistics like these are often overlooked in media. We are here to shed light on the facts. Suicide is the tenth leading cause of death in America, equaling to about 44,100 deaths every year. For every suicide, about 25 people attempt. Two-thirds of people who commit suicide are suffering from depression before their death. Those who are diagnosed with depression are about 20 times more likely to commit suicide. The treatment for depression is effective, but only about 25% of those with depression seek treatment. Women attempt suicide three times more often than men do, but men are four times as likely to successfully complete suicide. Seven out of ten completed suicides are done by males. The main method of suicide for women is poisoning, and for men it's firearms. In 2015, the highest rate of suicide was among adults ages 45 to 64. And in 2015, 12.5% of all suicides were from young adults ages 15 to 24. 14% of high school students have considered suicide, and almost 7% have attempted it. For every suicide among young people, there are at least 100 attempts. Suicide is the third leading cause of death among young people. Bullying victims are two to nine times more likely to attempt suicide than people who do not experience bullying. Suicide is 100% preventable. The warning signs for suicide include, but are not limited to, increased use of alcohol or drugs, sleeping too much or too little, withdrawing or isolating self, talking about being a burden to others, and showing signs of self-harm. You are not alone. Suicide is preventable, but you can't do it on your own. If you suspect someone of being suicidal or you yourself are suicidal, help is available. The National Suicide Hotline is 1-800-273-8255. Someone is available 24 hours a day to help. I don't know what I'm supposed to do, haunted by the ghost of you.